Welcome to Learn with Priyanka. Question 89. You have a fabric tenant that contains a semantic model. The model contains 15 tables. You need to programmatically change each column that ends in the word key to meet the following requirements. What should you use? A. Microsoft Power BI Desktop B. ALM Toolkit C. Tabula Editor D. DAC Studio Pause the video and give it a think and check your answer. The correct answer is C. Tabula Editor because Tabula Editor is a powerful tool designed for managing and modifying Power BI and Analysis Services models. It allows you to programmatically apply changes to multiple columns, such as hiding them, setting properties like Nullable, Summarize By, Available in MDX, and marking columns as key columns. You can write a CNA script or use advanced object-level actions within Tabula Editor to apply these settings across all relevant columns in your model efficiently. All other options are incorrect. A. Microsoft Power BI Desktop is primarily used for building and designing reports, and while you can manually adjust column properties, it is not designed for batch processing or scripting changes across multiple columns. It would require a lot of manual effort to apply these changes to each column individually. B. ALM Toolkit is mainly used for comparing and deploying changes between different Power BI models or analysis services projects. It does not offer the same level of programmability or scripting capabilities as Tabula Editor for modifying multiple columns within a model. D. DAC Studio is a tool primarily used for writing, formatting, and analyzing DAX queries. It does not provide features for programmatically changing column properties in a semantic model. See you with another question. Make sure to like, share and subscribe for more videos.